Good morning, Richland High School. Thank you for reviewing RAM TV. Today is Tuesday, February 12, 2013. Student dismissals times are as follows. Monday, February 11th, 2.30, JV Girls Basketball. Note, team buses will depart 15 minutes after dismissal time listed above. All football players currently in grades 10, 11, and 12 will meet during the lunch on Thursday, February 14th. Players should take their lunches to room C-105 for this important meeting. February, Friday, February 15th is Whiteout Friday. Candy grams will be on sale through Thursday, February 14th in the cafeteria during lunch for 50 cents. You may purchase a lollipop or send one to someone. Candy grams will be distributed on Friday 15th during homeroom. You can also add a poem to your candy gram, which an RHS forensics member will read for additional 50 cents. The Cinema Club will be meeting after school in room D113 or LGI room to view the True Life Tsunami drama. The Impossible starring Naomi Watts, all members are asked to attend and all are encouraged to bring snacks refreshments for the group. It is not too late to join, so if anyone else is interested in watching movies, see Mr. Jacobs for details. Congratulations to the Swimming Rams on their outstanding performances at the Indiana High School Invitational at Saturday at IUP. Mackenzie Yagadich won the 50 freestyle and placed second in the 20 free. Nathan Mihalko came home with silver medals in the 100 back and 100 fly, breaking his pre previous school record set in February 2012. Other top 12 place finishers were Boys 200 Medley Relay, Mihalko, Josh Schneider, Aaron Cooper, Julius Eckroth, Juli Girls 200 Free Relay, Haley Legenfelder, Ashley Rovder, Lindsay Bose, and Lindy Rumdy. Boys 200 Free Relay, Julius Eckroth, Josh Schneider, Aaron Cooper, and Nathan Mahalko. 500 Freestyle, Haley Winters, and Julius Eckroth. 100 Backstroke, Haley Legenfelder, 100 Breaststroke, Josh Schneider, and Girls 400 Free Relay, Haley Winters, Lindy Rumsey, Caitlin Appel, and Mackenzie Agadich. The Swimming Rams conclude their dual meet season Friday at home against Cambria Heights beginning at 5 p.m. Freshman and sophomore class fundraising forms and money are due to Mrs. Gress by Tuesday, February 19th. Please place your forms and money in the envelope with your name on it. If you need another form or have a question, please stop by D108. Any 7th or 8th grade student has special interest and talent in mathematics or science can apply for the summer's Adam Scholars program. Applications are available in the guidance office and need to be returned by February 21st. Sign-ups for spring sports are underway in the athletic office. Spring sports include varsity basketball, softball, boys tennis, boys track and girls track, junior high, boys track, girls track, and girls volleyball. All participants in spring sports must complete paperwork. Only those who are participating in sports for the first time in 12 and 13 school year or may any fall winter sport athlete who had an injury that kept them from competing the se completing the season need to see a doctor. The entire packet <laughs> may be returned to the athletic office by Wednesday, February 20th, 2013. Athletes will not pr be permitted to practice until all forms are completed. The first day of practice for spring sports is March 4th, 2013. Waynesburg University is offering a CSI camp from June 16th to June 21st. Visit their site at csicamp.waynesburg.org or sign up in the guidance office for additional information. As always, please check the school bulletin in Power School for all announcements. And this lovely thing that is sitting behind us is an animatronics that was used for TSA.